Our next guest invites you to embark on a waffle adventure, really. Um, we've got Depita patients here. Welcome from the Belgian Waffle Cart. Glad you're here. Thank you so much for inviting me. I appreciate that. Absolutely. This is quite a business you operate. You have authentic flavors of Belgium because that's where you're from. First, tell us a little bit about what brought you to the upstate. Okay, so what brought me here is my dream. Mm -hmm. uh, long time I say I want to come to live here in America because I love American people and I love the way they talk English. And when I came here, I didn't know how to speak English at all. So, yeah, I learned to talk English here and I'm very happy to be here. Well, you sound great. How many years have you been here? Uh, this year going to be five years. Okay. So you land in the upstate and you think, I want to create a business. Um, tell me what we're standing in front of, what you can do with this cart. I can do the authentic Belgian waffles with the fresh strawberry, uh, blueberry, bananas, Nutella, peanut butter, and uh, I have all this sauce, and this is the authentic Belgium waffles. So this is the Liège waffles. In Belgium, we have two kinds of waffles. We have Bruxelles and we have Liège. And this is the Liège waffles with the sugar peel. Okay, so it, it's, a, it's crispy yet pillowy, and the process would be, if that were hot enough, you would pour the, the uh, waffle batter in there and then dress it all up. Um, what does somebody do when, when you bring this cart, somebody picks all their toppings? Kind of walk us through that process. Okay, so when somebody asks me, I make the, the waffles just here in the mm -hmm. waffles maker, and I put the uh, strawberry. So the, the customer choose which topics he want to you know have in the, his waffles. Mm -hmm. And what do you recommend? My best one, I love the waffles with peanut butter, banana, and and whipped cream and the caramel on the top. Okay. Um, and I was looking at your list of toppings. You've got marshmallows, you mentioned the Nutella, dark chocolate, white chocolate, pecans, whipped cream, strawberries, blueberries, bananas, and bacon. Bacon makes good for everything. Yeah. I would have mine with bacon if we were making them today. Yeah. Um, what do you hope your customers get out of the experience that you can bring this authentic cuisine to them? Um, can you just repeat? Because like I said, I'm still learning to talk English. Oh. What do you hope your customers feel after they eat your food? What do you want them to take home with them? Love. Yep. Because everything about me, about what I'm doing, is love. So when my customers eat, they're so happy, and I have some, they're just crying. And yes, everything is about love, because mm -hmm. I'm a love people. You want to share your love. A lot of people that uh, serve food, I find that they food is love. Um, let's, and this, so this cart, it's a pretty, pretty big rig. You pull this behind a vehicle. You can go to places, whether it is an event or a festival, or you would even cater. What, what kind of event might someone bring you in for to cater? Uh, I go to the event. I go to the, um, the festival. I do also the wedding, the birthday party. The, uh, you know, I go to the people. Absolutely. Well, um, it, it, it's a beautiful setup, and, and I'm sorry I didn't get you plugged in in time to, to be able to sample this waffle, but, uh, but I know it's really wonderful. Anything else you want people to know about uh, what you love about this business and, and maybe living in America? Uh, so first, I'm very happy to be here. I'm very happy to share my authentic Belgium waffles. So what I want people to um, is to come and to to taste my authentic Belgian waffle because it's the best one okay. of the upstate. Wonderful. Well, this Belgian waffle cart can be found at uh, local festivals, at pop-up shops, catering events, and people can learn more on your website. Thank you very much for being here. We appreciate it.